This video will teach students how to upload a photo to Artsonia. First, how to do it on a Chromebook, and then how to do it on a phone or tablet. You will start by going to my Bitmoji classroom and clicking the Artsonia logo. If you are doing it on a Chromebook or a desktop computer, this will take you to this page. Click on the Artsonia logo to go to the website. Over in the far right corner, you will see a little button that says Log In. Click that. Then click the blue button that says Student. Now make sure you're signing in with the school access code. Do not sign in with Google. The code is back in the Bitmoji classroom. You will type in the code here. It will always be the same code. It will not change for our school. Then click which grade you are in. Your name should already be in the list, so start typing your name to find it. Then it'll show you projects that I have assigned to your grade level. Click the project. There may or may not be instructions. Then click the green button that says Add Artwork. If you're on a Chromebook, you need to pause and go open the app for the camera. Once the camera is open, hold your artwork up to the screen and take a picture. It'll save it in your files. Then you can go to select image back in Artsonia, find the image on your computer. Mine's going to look a little different because I'm using a Mac, not a Chromebook. Double click the image and click upload now. You should see your image. Now you have a lot of choices to edit if you need to. You can crop, you can turn it. The most important one is the blur name. Make sure your name is not in your artwork. Then click next. Please put in an art title. And then click turn in title. Sometimes I might give you an artist statement prompt or other times there are just these general questions. Please write a little artist statement describing your artwork. Turn in statement. Then you are done. You can see the artwork that you've turned in and then I will check it and make sure it looks good and you can log out. Now if you are doing it on a phone or a tablet, first you have to download the Artsonia app. You will click students, then you'll go to your computer screen back in the Bitmoji classroom and scan the QR code. Click the grade level you're in type your name, click it. Now there's the one that I just did a minute ago. You're going to hit the orange plus sign, click the project you're uploading it to, take a new photo, then take a really nice photo of your artwork. Make sure it's nice and straight, clear, no crazy shadows, and you can click use photo. Now mine is sideways. I need to hit the rotate button and then I'm going to move the white circles so that it's just my artwork. It's cropping it down to just my artwork. Now if my name was on this I can hit blur and I'll show you on the coffee cup where there's words. Blur out and then click apply blur. We don't want your name on your artwork. Sometimes it takes a minute to apply the blur but wherever you scribble with your finger, it's going to blur it out. There we go. Then you'll click Submit. And here is where you can add a title to your artwork. You should always title your artwork. Click Submit. And then if there's not an artist statement prompt, you can write whatever you'd like to, to describe your artwork. If there is a prompt, you need to answer it, and then click Submit. Now, I have to review all of your artwork once it's been posted. Now, you can see after I refreshed it, there's only one there, because I reviewed one and said it was okay to put on Artsonia. If you click Artwork in the bottom right, you can see that I reviewed it, and you can see there's teacher feedback. 
where I can leave you comments and suggestions about your artwork. Great job! Let's get started.